Next one is another great series of drills. These are developed by the All-American basketball player at in Indiana, Steve Alford. We're calling these the Alford drills. He always starts out these drills by spinning the ball out, left foot pivot. The first one is he's going to take a jump shot. Okay? He's going to grab his own rebound. He's going to hustle up after it, turn, spin, try to pivot with his left foot, Okay, going out. Different parts of the court. He's always taking a different shot. Doing a nice job with this. Spin, trying to work on your left foot pivot as much as you can. Okay, straight shot, good pivot. Okay, this is the straight miking, a straight Alfred drill, excuse me. Okay, the next one, next Alfred drill we're going to do is the same thing, but Corey's going to take one dribble, free himself up, okay. All right, and then he's going to take a jump shot. Okay, hustles after the ball. This is a little known. This is a little known um, a weapon that you can use in basketball. You don't need to take a lot of dribbles to be effective. One dribble will usually free you up, particularly if you're a good jump shooter. So he's, he can use a, a pump fake. Usually, you lead with the foot that you're going in the direction you're going to go. Good pump fake. Nice job. Good jump stop, okay. One dribble and a jump and a jump shot. Nice job. Good. The next variation we have in our offer drills is Corey's going to do the same thing, but he's going to do nothing but shoot backboard shots. Once again, an underused shot in basketball, okay. He's going to put himself on different parts of the court where it'll allow him to shoot the ball against the backboard. Even this could be utilized in the front of the rim when you need high trajectory in a shot and you got a bigger player against you. Okay? So he's just working on his backboard shots. All these offered drills will be done in two minute increments. After he gets done doing a certain drill, then he'll shoot ten free throws to rest and then he moves on to the next one. Okay, that's good. All right, the next drill we have that Corey is going to demonstrate is what we call creative offered drill. And what he's going to do is he can do pretty much whatever he wants. He tries to limit to the two dribbles, okay? He spins the ball out. He can go between his legs, behind his back, crossover dribble, spin dribble, nice jump shot, whatever he'd like to do, okay? All right? You can utilize some of these moves. He wants to go to the basket. If he wants to pull up and get a jump shot, whatever, whatever appeals to him at that time, okay? All right? This is what we call our creative.